Monday movie hunting. The best way to start your week. Da -da 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 -da. Yay! Okay, so we're on Monday movie hunting today, and I'm very excited. I'll be picking up two movies. I made a mistake last week, guys. I am sorry. I put a little annotation. I put a little comment. Um, yeah, I said I was picking up one, and one movie that I thought was coming out next week is coming out this week. I believe. I don't know. Maybe I'll be wrong now. Maybe we'll get to see if that won't be true. So the movie that I told nobody to guess because I didn't even know it was coming out this week was Room. I've been really looking forward to this movie and I was definitely going to be picking it up. So I thought, well, that's going to really confuse the guessing. Um, yeah, so the movie that, you know, that was Room. And the movie that was to guess, it was really kind of split down the middle with people who guessed. Okay, the choices were The Danish Girl and The Hateful Eight. And a lot of people guessed either or, like, it was really, um, people said, you know, I wouldn't know which one to guess, it's kind of a hard one, and it definitely was, that's why I was kind of worried about that one, but the movie that I will be picking up today is, dun dun dun, The Hateful Eight. So, I think actually more people did guess The Danish Girl, but some people still did guess The Hateful Eight. Um, but yeah, I've been really looking forward to this movie, actually, I thought it looked really interesting. I really enjoyed Django Unchained, um, which obviously was Quentin Tarantino's movie before this one. And yeah, so The Danish Girl I would like to see, but it's not kind of on my soon to see, need to see list. But anyway, let's go on to movie hunting. Let's hope they have The Hateful Eight and Room. And then we'll talk about next week at the end because there won't be any guessing because I'll be uploading a Monday movie not hunting video where I just kind of talk about the movies that are coming out and then put in the thing to guess for the week after. Does that make sense? Because I'm, I'm not going to be here, so I have to upload, schedule it. Anyway, let's go Monday movie hunting. Okay guys, so they don't actually have the Danish girl, so I don't know, I'm confused. Where is it? Is it out today? Is it not? I'll find out later. Okay everybody, so welcome back from Money Movie Hunting. So the day started off like well and then it all spiralled downhill but I won't go into that now because this is Monday Movie Hunting. Sometimes I like share really weird things in Money Movie Hunting but we're here to talk about the movies. So we have The Hateful Eight and room and as you guys thought the danish girl doesn't come out until next week so i really don't know what happened there it's really weird okay so because of the danish girl incident i thought that today the hateful eight came out and the danish girl came out and i thought that next week room came out and another movie came out but that wasn't the case i don't know what happened i feel like it switched around i feel like everybody thought the danish girl came out this week i really don't know so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the people who guessed The Hateful Eight, which was the one movie because I messed up last week and didn't know Room came out. Um, so the people who guessed The Hateful Eight, I will give you guys a point. So well done if you did. We'll go to that in a minute. And the people, oh, that was a bee. Uh, the people who guessed The Danish Girl, I'm just going to keep you, this bee is big. I'm just going to keep you at the same uh, thing. I'm not going to lose you a point. I'm just going to, everybody who guess they have like gets the point, everybody else is, will be on the same thing next week. Like, we're just going to carry it on through because I think it confused everybody. I mean, I still wasn't picking up the Danish girl, but I think it's only fair. And I, this morning when I thought that, I was in a really good mood and I was like, yes, that's what I'll do. Uh, so yeah, hopefully that's good for you guys. Um, you guys will stay the same. So now let's go for the people who guessed correctly with the hate flight. Let's skip ahead to the spreadsheet. Okay, these are the people who guessed correctly this week. We have Spooner Mom, EVOX Warriors. Um, and again, if you did not guess, and if or if you guessed the Danish girl, these scores on the row before 
oops, my computer is telling me something, will be the same. Um, you know, when we do the other guessing. Kevin Hay. And then Mason T123 is the first person to get to seven on this list. Um, we have Hunter Gassaway and Simon Wayne. Benjamin Gill and David um, Janison. And then at the bottom we have James Stewart. So there we go. There's everybody who guessed correctly. And let's go back to the other me. Okay, so well done if you guessed the hate plate, but if not, no worries, you still have the same amount of points. So that was lucky. Um, now then next week, I will be picking up one movie, but there won't be any guesses um, because I'm gonna be away. So I won't be able to sort out the guesses. Does that make sense? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upload a video Monday movie not hunting discussing the one movie that I'll be picking up and any other movies that come out that week and then on that video you can guess for the following week so make sure to check out that video next Monday so that you can put your guesses down for the Monday after so everybody who's got their points you'll be able to guess next week on next Monday for the week after and then you'll carry on with the points so make sure to do that um but yeah so um I think now we can take a look at the hateful eight and room should we take a closer look at them too because that seems like a fun way to do it, but I don't do specific, specific unboxings. I like to do a little bit here. So let's have a look at the Hateful Eight and Room. Okay guys, here is a slip cover for the Hateful Eight. Here's the back. And special feature wise, we have behind the eight, behind the scenes look, and Sam Jackson's guide to a glorious 70 millimeter. Can you guys see that? No. You see it now? No. Sorry. Uh, I don't think it helps I'm outside and there's so much going on. There we go, you can see it now. Um, the special features are the same on the DVD as well. Here's some little look at the specifications. Um, there's no subtitles. How long is this movie? How long is this movie? It doesn't say. Oh, 167 minutes. Wow! It is a long movie. I did not know that. That is crazy. Long movie. Okay. Oh, wow! That is pretty cool, that disc. Look at that. I like that. But no digital copy which is sad i like the digital copy so wah, wah. here is a slip cover for room i'm really looking forward to this one here is the back special feature swire it's got audio commentary uh 11 times 11 feature rep making room cast and crew there's the pictures and runtime is 117 minutes um and yeah so there is there is that and then here it is and i'm pretty sure this one doesn't have a digital copy either so i don't know what's with that right now um oh what is that is that a digital copy or is that just a uh, it's an advert for the novel but look the picture on the disc is different too oh guys are on a really win with the picture discs today so that is good that makes the day better good picture discs well done what are they studio companies i don't know i want to say publishing companies but that's books uh, but yeah room is a book i have not read the book that's okay i'm okay to just kind of watch the movie with this one i'm ready for it so yeah, I picked up Room and The Hateful Eight today. Super excited to watch both of these. Okay guys, that is pretty much it for this week. Um, I will be filming next week's Money Move Hunting in a moment, so you guys will see me looking the same. Um, but make sure to tune in next Monday to put your guesses for the following Monday. We had a really fun lineup, uh, I think, the beginning of May has been kind of okay, but then the end of May, I've got some really exciting pickups I'm going to be picking up, and June looks pretty exciting as well. So I can't wait to kind of pick up a lot of those movies. Um, yeah, thumbs up if you enjoy Money Movie Hunting. Let me know if you've seen The Hateful Eight or Room. Let me know if you know what happened with The Danish Girl. Was it supposed to come out today? Was it not? I don't know. Um, um, but yeah, so I don't know. It'll be out next week, and you guys know, obviously, that I won't be picking it up because I didn't know it wasn't out this week and I wasn't picking it up then. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys next week. I'll be talking about the movies that are released next week and I will be talking about how many movies I'll be picking up the week after. It'll probably be a short video, obviously, because there won't be any hunting involved and there won't be any movies involved because I won't have the movie yet because it'll be now, not next week. You guys get it though. You can put your guesses there though and that's kind of mainly what that video is for so that we don't lose the guessing game. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys are happy that you didn't lose your guesses because of that confusion and I'll see you guys next week. Thank you for watching. I'll see you then. Goodbye.